There too, huh? Every door in this place is locked up tight. How about that one? May as well give it a try. Jumpy! Huh? Hey! June? And Santa! And Lotus too! Okay, where are we now? Okay, we're still, we're still on that path. Whoa! What the hell is this? Okay, so once we get off of this path, we can just skip through everything else until we get to that last uh, path. What are you doing here? What? But we didn't... Hey guys! Could you come take a look at this? Look on the wall here. A map of the ship's interior? It says Sea Deck. So it's the map for this floor then? Door 7 and... Door 8. Yep, they both eventually end up at this hallway. Yeah, isn't that what I said? We aren't going to be split up permanently till we find door 9. We might get separated for a little while, but we'll see each other again. Otherwise, we won't be able to open door 9. And that's how the nonary game works. I see. Wait a sec. Hey, could this lead to... Oh! You've got to be kidding me. We may as well go. Yeah. Oh, I almost forgot. We should keep this. Ready? I'm gonna open it. Do it! I knew it. We're back. Welcome back. In the hospital room. It's still not there yet. I see. I believe I understand what you're saying. The six of you split into two teams and went through doors seven and eight. You solved the puzzles in the operating room and the laboratory and then met one another in the hallway after opening your respective locked doors. At any rate, I feel a bit silly for my little show of altruism. I know I said I was sure you'd come back for me. I didn't think it would happen so soon, though. Well, we saw each other again and we ain't dead, so I say that's good enough. Anyway, I said we get out of this creepy old place. We found the key we need. The key? Ain't that what I just said? I'm talking about the Jupiter key. We found it in the operating room. Right, Junpei? Yeah. Yep. Oh, the solar system keys. We found a couple more in the laboratory in the kitchen. Here. The Earth key and the Saturn key card. I might lose it. It's probably better if you hold on to it. That way it won't be my fault if it gets lost. Yeah. On it. Now we have three keys that we haven't used yet. Yeah. The Jupiter key that we found in the operating room the Earth key that Lotus just gave me, and the Saturn key card that Lotus said was in the kitchen. The Jupiter key is supposed to be for the door at the end of that long straight hallway, right? Yeah. If the map's right, then it connects to the central staircase. Then, next to the stairs. Wait! 
What about door three? Look, you saw the map, right? It's the same as seven and eight. It just lead us back to the big hospital room. There's no point to seeing what's oh, on the other side. Wow, of that I'm hearing. I'm not sure if that's gunshots or <laughs> or fireworks. That's the thing about Florida. Don't know which one is which. There is a point. We just got here and just wait till what happens. At least there is for me. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. Snake might be on the other side of door three. Very well. I'll be coming with you then. I've had a nice long rest. I think it's time I was up and about again. So, Seven, you'll help me, won't you? Huh? Me? Damn. Well, I guess that's how it's gotta be. So I'm going with you, huh? Yes, you are. All right. Let's get moving. Okay, okay, let's go, okay, let's go, let's out. go. Be careful. Are we there? Are we there? Okay, now we can skip through the rest of this. going on here hmm you know that's a good question I can't believe this you guys followed me here but you don't even know why uh, <laughs> Jinpei you've got the solar system keys don't you can I skip this now nope yeah. well, okay <laughs> the Saturn key card And the Earth key. What about it? Don't you remember the elevator? On Sea Deck, where we are now, there was a big elevator behind the stairs, remember? And next to the elevator, there was a card reader with the Saturn symbol on it. And on A deck, on the door to the left? There was a keyhole with the Earth symbol on it, I think. So, the two keys that Jumpy has? Should let us use the elevator and the door on A deck. Huh. Yes, that's right. All right, I got it. Let's get started then. What do you say we split into two teams? Lotus and I will search the Earth one, so you two can search Saturn, all right? Sounds good. Then you guys should take this key. We have no idea what's on the other side of these. Can I skip? Okay, there we go. Skip, skip, skip. You locked them alone with the boy? We will be all alone in here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, girls don't play with my feelings man you are all you are all la, 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 like oh there's a bag you know just for the two of us right like don't don't play like that don't play my no. games oh uh, nothing it's not important <laughs> come on let's go I said, wait a minute.
Why? Aren't you afraid, Jumpy? Afraid of what? Well, I've never... You know... It's your first time? Hey, anyone knows? I might... Get wet. Hey. <laughs> uh, oh, what? Down there. I get soaking wet. Uh, hey, hey. Well, I, I mean, of course you would. That's the way it works. <laughs> I mean, I've never heard of anyone getting soaking wet uh, somewhere else. Do, do they? We've been through this, but uh, timeline differences. Uh, that's that's true. Uh, we, we, we when I we don't even know what I'm talking about. You don't mind? Mind what? Getting wet. Speaking more detail, woman. Well, uh, I don't know. I think I'd probably, um, you know, like it. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I, I, I'm turning off the volume and letting this play through. <laughs> oh, the, the, the audio, like. It's crazy, just like, uh... Gosh, Jumpy. You're so brave. Really? I mean, I kind of think any guy would do the same thing, you know? What happens, happens, right? I mean, if you get the chance, you've just got to go for it. And that's what a man is supposed to do. I guess. You're so cool, Jumpy. I really admire you. Uh, are, are, are they done with, with the innuendos and stuff like that? Uh, that doesn't really seem like the sort of thing you ought to admire someone for. I... I'm really scared. Oh, no, no, no! Yeah, they, they, I they, mean, they, like they. you said, you've never done it before. No, oh, no, no, they're, they're still not done. I don't remember this in the original game, but oh boy. Oh boy. Yes. So, I don't think I'll be able to last very long. And then it'll be over. Oh, I bet the voice, the voice actors had a heck of a time recording this. Even though they do record one at a time, I bet reading it on the screen would be like, like they, were, they were just laughing their butt off. Uh, over? Yes. I'll go to heaven. Uh. <laughs> heaven? It feels kind of like you're floating in space, and your mind gets all fuzzy, like when you pass out. At least that's what I've heard from people who have experienced it. Ah, uh, yes, I've I've heard that too. Although I, I don't think the same thing happens to guys. Oh, sorry. happen to men too wouldn't it it would happen to anyone once it gets into your body the same thing happens to everyone oh well i i mean um usually it, it, it doesn't go inside the man i, I mean generally uh, just stop just stop 
<laughs> Enough with this. It's been gone too long. We get it. You Jube was thinking they were gonna do it. They're gonna bang, but it's not talking about that. She's talking about water. God dang it. Yes, it does. Well, eventually it will. It's not like you really have a choice. Your body will force you to swallow some of it. Ah! Uh, come on, finish what this you already. To do to me? Nothing. I'm not going to do anything to you. I'm just saying that that's what happens. It's a psychological reaction to what you're experiencing. Oh, is that so? <laughs> I know most men probably have larger lungs, but even then, I don't think you could hold your breath for 20 or, or even 10 minutes. Oh, okay. Thank you. We're, we're, we're leaving all that cringy Eventually, stuff. Eventually, you'd have to breathe, and then the water would get into your lungs. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Finally. The finally, she, she clarifies it. Oh, my God. Just like, oh. Finally. Oh. That was so much cringe. Once that happens, your body won't be able to get oxygen anymore. And you'll start to feel that floaty feeling as you pass out. Uh. Huh. Oh. Hmm? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, now you're finally starting to realize that you're Now you're finally seeing what she was talking about. She wasn't talking about doing it. No, that was all in your perfect mind. No, no, no. She's talking about freaking drowning. Because the bottom deck, they filled water, remember? <laughs> and now he's gone crazy. We did, guys. Junpei is finally in the nut house. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, and and to the right. loony bin. Didn't last very long. <laughs> Oh boy. See? <sighs> Come to think of it, the lower floor, D deck is completely underwater. Finally, you understand what she was talking about. Finally. An elevator heading to a submerged floor. That is pretty scary. Hey, wait a minute. This elevator came up from somewhere under us, right? Can I skip it now? Thank you. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't know how long I was gonna last in that cutscene to clarify. Oh. So cringy. So cringy. Well, probably get really wet up there. Huh? At any rate, we should probably go back as soon as we can, once we're done looking around down here. Okay. So it was just that that, that two lies, just you know, all that. Okay, uh ju just check. So you guys uh, found door one. Okay, we're about to head here. With door one, we got six and two. We're gonna head through door six. Oh boy. But seriously, that, that was, that was really cringy. Sure. Uh, something's still strange. Hmm? What was that? Well, I'm just wondering about one thing. 
And what's that? How can you be so sure that Zero's on this ship? Really, Junpei? I confess I'm a little disappointed. Usually you're rather sharp. Isn't it obvious? Wait, it is? This ship... Huh? <clears throat> Zero said, this ship, several times when he addressed us. Okay, this ship. He, he doesn't have to say, like, oh, hey, I am, you know, I'm the captain of this ship. He doesn't mean that he's actually on the ship. The voice could say, uh, like, uh, like, when he's projecting to them, like, oh, yeah, I am the captain of the ship, but uh, I'm not on the ship. I'm, I'm off the ship. I'm off the ship. <laughs> If he weren't here, he wouldn't say this ship, would he? He'd be saying something like, that ship, or the ship. Oh, yeah, I, I guess that makes sense. If Zero's on the ship, where is he? I think... Zero is one of us. Okay, so we can skip all that. And I'll go with that crazy. That's crazy. Isn't this ship going to sink in a few hours? If Zero was here with us, he'd be putting himself in danger. Why the hell would he do something like that? There's no motive. You don't believe me. You don't feel that you can trust any of us. But you have to understand. The more we distrust one another, the further we fall into our true foe's trap. Zero was the one who did those horrible things to your brother. Do you want to let yourself be manipulated by someone who would do such a horrible thing? <laughs> oh boy and just skip to that then we need to move now okay seven clover again if we took door one last time we're gonna hit the door six I think this will be door two Okay. I know how you feel, but you do understand that right now it's important we trust one another, don't you? We must go. We have very little time left. Our next destination is Mercury. But maybe you and June should check it out first and then report back to us. All right. Let's go, June. Right. Here it is. Okay, skip.
Oke, okay, uh... wait, hon, 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 uh... San June is door six, seven Lois is door two. Okay, uh, yeah, let's go with doors. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Oh, dang. I was wondering, because, well, what if it's out of order? Because, like, in the previous, like, in the timeline, last, but it was the first two on the, uh, timeline, and the three number three door was the last one so let's go with six I want to go through door six that's a problem none of these teams will be able to go through the doors they want Clover and I chose door one Lotus and I chose door two that's not enough people to open a numbered door however the digital routes don't match up either we've got similar problems June, Junpei, and I want to go through door six, but our digital route is five. If we're gonna open that door, we need a one. Damn, what are we gonna do now? What are we going to do? Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> Why don't Seven and Lotus go through door one with me? <sighs> uh. What about me? Isn't that obvious? Wasn't one of the teams just complaining that they didn't have a one? You mean I should join Santa's team? Yes. Well, duh. Huh. I understand. I'll go through door six then. If we do as Clover has suggested, we can all pass through a numbered door and no one will be left behind. Hmm. This seems to be the most reasonable solution. Seven, Lotus, what do you guys think? I don't have a problem with it. Me either. All right then, we're good to go. See you later. Wait, Clover! Don't move on your own. Oh, I'll be going too then. Yep. Yeah. Be careful. We should get going as well. This is E deck. There should be a door at the end of the hall. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Here it is. You guys ready? Yeah. And let's get to it. Hey, I found it. It's right there. Uh Getting close. Oh, it stopped. Yes, it stopped. Whew. I don't believe I'll ever get used to that. I'm not sure it's something I'd want to get used to. We should finish this game before imminent death becomes a normal thing. <laughs> you got that right. Once I'm out of this hellhole, I'm taking a nice long vacation. <laughs> I agree. All right, let's go. This door looks heavy. But it's not locked. I'm opening it. Whoa, what the Whoa. hell is this? 
This has to be the biggest room so far. The ceiling is pretty high, too. Huh. Could be two stories. Maybe even more. This space could be utilizing the entire length of the ship. What's that huge Kamaboko-looking building in the middle? Kamaboko? Kamaboko? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess that's as good of a description of it as any. I see stairs, so we may as well head over to them. Yeah, okay. but this section's barely wide enough to fit one person. You're right. Whoa, you can't even tell the shape when you're this close. Let's check out the other side, too. This looks to be the steam engine room. The steam engine room? Yes, that thing that looks like a cross-section of a mushroom is the boiler. You see the three round doors near the bottom? Coal is put into those and burned, which heats the water, producing steam. The same thing that drives a steam engine. This one is simply somewhat larger. I see. It doesn't appear to be running right now. All right, let's split up. Hey, what's wrong? Are you all right? Oh. <laughs> hey, June. Jumpy. You, oh, you're, you're really warm. Is your fever coming back? I hope it's not. Yes. Yes. It probably is. But I'm fine. Please don't worry about me. Really? Hmm. I just need to rest. And I'll be fine. Okay, okay. Uh, here, sit down. Uh, careful. You. Ace, Santa. Yes. Right. All right, let's get started. Hang in there, June. I'm going to get you out of here real soon. Okay, let's do this. Let's seek a way out. Okay, the steam engine room. Okay, so we got a box here. Okay, nothing happens. Okay, nothing here except three slots. It's not a square. It's a rectangle. Oh. oh, oh, okay, okay. You talk about the, the hole itself. Okay, so nothing there. I say it's probably here to move coal from place to place. It's probably come from over there, and then the bell carries it down the tunnel and out here. So if the comparator bell was moving, yes, the coal would almost certainly come out here. This pillar goes up towards the ceiling. Uh, sorry about that guys, I was interrupted. Uh, anyways, uh... Okay, tunnel. We just started this place, so... We gotta explore. Okay, we got a golden wheel. Gear wheel, same difference. <laughs> okay, so there must be something important with it. Okay, there's a door. Okay, so the coal goes there, but it's welded shut. Maybe it leads to an exit, maybe on the other side.
Okay, we got bronze. Bronze gear. Doors also welded shut. Okay, and what about all the way over here? Silver. I think this may appear silver. Steel iron. Okay, conveyor belt. Okay, so. Okay, and we can see the uh, side of here. One boxes. Okay, uh, can we go up? Okay, we can. But before we go up, let's look around here a bit more. A pair of one boxes. There's nothing in them. Snowman secret, snowman secret treasures, or something like that. Maybe we can put the sands on here because it looks like these two are part of a scale of some sort. So maybe, or maybe not. Okay, uh, what's here? Okay. Also, uh, yes, we are on the middle path. Okay. Now, what? Now, whichever locks, I don't know. Okay, so up the stairs. Okay, two columns are different. Two columns are different from the others. The lights are red. <clears throat> okay, the second. Okay, that won't work. Third time's a charm. Okay, how about this one? Okay, so that works. Okay, let's go a bit more. Hmm. Side. Okay, so we're above the conveyor belt. Okay, A, C, and B. All right. Can go that way, so we gotta go this way. Okay, what's in B? Okay, we're on this side. Okay. Can't do anything here. Let's head to the other side and head for a C. Okay, what else can we do? Can't operate a wrench, but nothing to operate with. Okay, so we're missing the wheel for this. Let's check on the other side because I think there was a wrench that, or at least something. Yeah, this.
and it came off. Okay, so now that we have that, we can use it on the other one. So let's head back to B, head into C, and see what will happen. Excuse me. Ooh. What's happening? Real turns locked. Okay, we're bringing it down. Should I be all the way. Box oh. reached the floor. Oh, oh, okay. You're just gonna talk when I'm talking. Yeah. June's down over by there. She doesn't seem to be improving. Well, of course not. She's not gonna just get better right away, you know? It'll take time. What could be causing this, I wonder? Illness, perhaps? Nah, Maybe. it's gotta be exhaustion. She gets dropped into some weird ass ship. Forced to play some messed up game. If you think about it, it's a lot weirder that we aren't freaking out just like her, you know? So you're saying we're abnormal? Yeah. We're just running around this room, solving all these puzzles like it's just business as usual. How the hell could you call that normal? We're just guinea pigs. A guinea pig? You mean like a lab rat? You mean we're being used for some sort of experiment? Huh. Is that what you're saying? Dunno. But it does seem like a possibility, you know? Okay, uh, can we get the wheel back? Nope, all, all right. So we're just gonna head back down, head through A. Uh, can we go through here? Like, it looks like there's not passageway to get through there, but nope. And we just, let's head back down. Okay, uh, where where do we have to get? Uh, no. Perfect for what? Oh, 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 I, I, I get it. I, I get it. Mm. Little nasty. Okay, gotta do something. Gotta do something. You don't want to go back up. Oh. Ah, uh, the control panel. Like, I did not even see that. So, put this in here. Press the orange button, crunk. 
and it turns on. Cool. Looks like a bunch of it got dumped off at the end of the conveyor belt into the one box we found on the control panel. Box filled with coal. Okay, so, uh, how about we go over here and put it on top of this? Okay, nothing, uh... Can't, can't put it in that. Okay. Okay, try and figuring this out. Try and figure this out. <sighs> Excuse me. Ooh. Okay, nothing happens. Go back up. The only thing in here and there is a closed number door. No, uh, god dang it. Can't walk me out. <laughs> no way, meow. <laughs> Okay, came through there. Let's go through the sea. Okay, now how do I get there? That's a problem. Can I take the rope down? Cause like it's not that hard to just like climb the rope down. We should be able to. There's a wheel on it. Really trying to figure this out. We're trying to see what, what, what I have to do. It looked just like ladder, like for real. Uh. 
Oh, I, I don't want to use a guide for this. Okay, well, what am I missing? What am I missing? I, I want to go with June is, but it won't let me. press this okay mm. barrels that does nothing for me. Okay, we can't do anything here. There's the boxes. Yes, I know. Okay, what am I missing? What am I missing? Because I basically went through all the parts, but I'm trying to find where June is. And it should be somewhere over here. Or somewhere. Okay, so how, how I put like the coal in <sighs> Excuse me Okay, so we can't go. Okay, we're, we're we're facing up there to the left. We can't go anywhere there. Oh my god! Like, when we go through C, 
to the left there's that giant thing and we can't go anywhere past that <sighs> I wish there was like some way that that we can just like like similar to Telltale's where there's like an like a little mark that says oh hey you can interact with this kind of wish there was one here through here again that goes here This is really confusing, really confusing. Okay, we're on the bottom floor. Come on, really? Really? Oh my god. Are you playing on are you playing to stoke the furnace with coal? Which will heat the water stored up in there to make steam, which will then drive something else. In other words, you want to generate enough pressure with the steam to power the turbine and drive the steam engine, right? Yeah, I guess that's the guess of it. Well, in that case, this is enough coal. The furnace, the furnace, the furnace is enormous. So we're gonna need a whole, a whole hell of a lot more coal than this. Well then, if the three of us work together, then we should manage to fill it much faster. I didn't even see her walk up. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Ra yeah, right. Look, you look like you're one step breeze away from falling over, June. I think you better rest some more, alright? But, I... No arguing. You need to rest. So you, so you just stay there. We'll handle this. Okay, I understand. Alright, time for some manly work. Let's get this cult into those furnaces. And they just bring it in.
Okay, uh, we don't have anything to light it with. Okay, so they're all lit up, so... Big gears turning. Okay. Ah. Okay. They're spinning. Okay, so gold one. There's peace. Right here. Bronze disc. Just make sure that there is norm uh, dialogue in there. Okay, so uh, over here, go up here. I put it inside of here. Okay. Okay, instructions for operation. When the disc is touched, it will rotate a certain amount. When the white arrow is touched, the disc will or switch. Please know when the disc are switched, the angles for the disc are reset. Oh, oh, oh. Will this one fit? There we go. Uh, 